All right, number nine. Great white sharks might have secret social lives that we know nothing about. What? Yeah, researchers were monitoring great whites near uh, Guadalupe Island off the coast of Mexico. That's where they all hang out. And they found that some sharks would stick together for more than an hour while patrolling certain areas of water. And the reason why they chose to hang out together might be simple. They may have discovered that they can kill larger prey when they work as a team. Mm. Uh -huh. They mostly go for tuna and big colonies of seals. To read more about it in the Royal Society of Biology Letters, the old mm. RSOBI yeah. for short. It's a, it's a fantastic read. If you haven't yeah. tried it, yeah. Yeah. great bathroom reading. Yeah. Oh, that was nice. Thanks, Pat. Mm. Uh, number eight, when it comes to your retirement, you might want to think about the FIRE approach. FIRE stands for Financial Independence Retire Early. But in order to do it, you'll have to make some sacrifices. According to financial experts, you must cut expenses drastically and live off of 25 to 50 percent of your income. Ah. And then take that money and invest it into low fee funds like index funds. You lost me already. Yeah. The main takeaway here is live off of 25 to 50 percent oh, of boy. your income. If you do that, uh, you have a better shot at retiring. Ah. Early. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. All right, number seven, there are all sorts of wives' tales and such about pregnancy, but in a few cases, science actually backs it up. For example, some say boys come with a long and difficult labor. And a study in Ireland found women who delivered boys had slightly longer labor and were more likely to run into complications during the delivery requiring C-sections. Yeah, I disagree. I had two girls and uh, mine were not easy. All right. Another bit of folk wisdom says to have a girl stay away from bananas. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm sure Everybody there's a lot of science that. behind yeah. that, Larry. Yeah. <laughs> and a British study of calorie intake and specific nutrients found that eating plenty of potassium, which bananas are full of, was linked to boys. But other pregnancy myths are not true. Cravings won't indicate birthmarks mm. on the baby's skin. Long walks do not induce labor. And the full moon has nothing to do with the timing of the birth. It's wives' tales, huh? I always wives. thought it was wives' tales. I don't know, wives, no. yeah. All these old years. wives' tales. Because wives yeah. make yeah. up so much Something stuff that isn't true. Yeah. 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 That's yeah. the beauty of mm -hmm. coming here every day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like, is it buck naked or is it? Butt naked. Thank you. I think it Don't can be know. both. It yeah. Can it? I believe yeah. it can be. I think yeah. those are interchangeable. Okay. Yeah. But I think originally it was buck naked. Really? I believe. But I don't Larry? Know. I don't, I don't really know. care that much. Okay. But. Yeah. Also, it's, it's not what in the Sam Hill. No. It's Sam, Sam Hill. Hill. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Who he is. Yeah. There's another couple yeah. of those out there also. Hey, I yeah. got a, I got yeah. a list ready for Thursday. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank well, you. Oh, Take that, Kelly and Regis. <laughs> <laughs> you know Regis is the yeah, yeah, I don't know. He I can't goes, keep, he they're goes, all the same. He goes to the well. Yeah. He can't help right. himself. Uh, number you six. Matt and Katie. <laughs> 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 number six, if you're looking to add a little bit of whimsy to your humdrum work life, yeah. try Monetry. It's a computer monitor with a built-in terrarium. Oh, that's delightful. You see the vines grow all around the monitor, so you have some calming nature around you as you wow. spend the day staring at emails and spreadsheets. It also includes a special LED light to help your plants grow. Look how happy you must have water. Uh, you have to water it with a, a syringe every now and then. Sure. Always good to get the water near the electric computer. Yeah. <laughs> wow, look at that. Uh, number five. Hey, how about some more slapping? Oh. This is a uh, oh, Japanese pro wrestler named Chono. <gasps> Jeez. Who made his way into Japanese game shows. They're called Batsu games, which are skits where one guy gets slapped or punished at the end. The guy he's hitting is Yamasaki. Oh, he's getting hit a lot. He gets hit a lot. Wow. You would think after one Ow. time, it's okay, that was enough. There must be money in it or something for him. It's for the laugh. That's what you want, though. He's going down like a sack of bricks every time, and he knows it's coming. Yeah. Well, signing up for it. Ah. It just makes Chris Rock taking it that much more impressive. Right. Yeah. I mean, Mike, yeah. All right, uh, All number right. four. 
Let's enjoy some groovy homes of the 70s, courtesy of Pulp Librarian. Great. What is that? Is that a bathroom with carpeting? Ah, it's good thinking there. That way we yeah. can get out of the tub. <laughs> Not on a cold, slippery now floor. Now get me a hams, lady. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, well, that's. Hey, you don't have to look at your children that way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Did you enjoy your dinner, honey? I'm just gonna put my feet up here with my sandals on, but I'm ready to go up and get whatever you need. <laughs> Number three, the man behind blue blocker sunglasses has passed away at age 83. Blue blocker sunglasses, they're really different. My name is Geek, I put them on as a shocker. Man, I love these blue blockers. Everything is clear, they block out the sun. Oh yeah, I gotta get me some. It's not like 3D, but it's got that effect where everything is so separated. They're great, best sunglasses ever on. I've been telling everyone I know about these, honest to goodness. It's different, I've never seen anything like these. Hmm. But Joe Sugarman did more than just give us one of the all-time great infomercials. He was an amazing marketer and entrepreneur. After time in the Army in the 60s, he came back to the Chicago area where he was born and started selling electronics like pocket calculators out of his family's basement in Northbrook. He was an innovator in mail order and one of the first to use an 800 number to take credit card orders. Sugarman believed in long-form copywriting and advertising. The Blue Blocker's sunglasses came uh, in 1986. Joe changed everything by creating half-hour infomercials. Blue Blockers stayed popular for decades and even made their way into movies. His family says Sugarman lectured internationally about advertising and direct marketing, always claiming to have failed more times than he succeeded. Oh, well, you know, what a great uh, Chicago story. Yeah. There, Larry, write yeah. that one down. Mm -hmm. All right, number two, here's a show that never made it past episode one. We can't imagine why. Take a look. What does Brady Bunch creator Sherwood Schwartz, plus Bob Denver, plus some of the most troublesome tots in the neighborhood equal? It equals the daffiest daycare center you ever saw. It equals scams. Hey, you guys, come here. I got a plan. And leading this unruly pack was none other than future teen heartthrob Joey Lawrence, delivering a performance that would make the little rascal Spanky McFarlane proud. Because it's a free country, that's why. I think Butts can say anything he wants. Me too. What does Brady buy? Oh, wow, I don't remember that at all. Mm -mm. 1982. Huh. All right, number one, we've shown those hack videos uh, from Blossom, and this is the one that started it all from a few years back. Uh, for a while, it was one of the most watched Facebook videos of all time, and it's all about clutter. Producer says 70% of these things work. Oh, look it. Instead of buying the special, just put rubber bands on the plastic hanger, it'll keep the shirts on. Uh, what? Oh, this, that's, I use this trick. Oh, do you? I sure do. What, what kind of tube do you put in? The old pool noodle. I don't see you wearing a lot of knee highs, though. Oh, I wear them all the time. Boots are do my you? thing in the winter, sure. Huh. Uh, that was life changing. That was. Yeah. That's a nine to nine. 